a lot. I miss the organ vibrating under my floor, an anthem that tickles the ceiling. I miss being splashed with baptism, the grit of rice, the weight of the casket when you let a loved one go. I miss the smell of bread cut into small enough everyone eats pieces. I miss people leaning over pew or chair back to say peace or hello or smile at a child. I even miss prickly poinsettias, lilies that make me sneeze, and the time it rained and animals came inside to be blessed. Puppy piddle or hot wax from those little candles, it doesn't matter, I miss you. But while you care for one another by being away, well, you'd know I exaggerate if I promise to self-dust the hymnals. I do promise to archive in my heart every song you've sung and all the voices, even the ones who only came here once, even those who pretend to sing. The pulpit has endured preachers spit and watching congregations doze, but it will store all that justice and comfort. Even if you remodel me someday or put me on a flatbed and roll me down the street, even if I burn down. All the memories will be in this ground and all the sky and some photographs to make you cry and lives changed, lots of lives changed forever. Now, before I go on too long, like a wandering sermon or a flat note held, and this is really a Christmas card, I want you to remember this, your loving sanctuary was never the manger or the field outside Bethlehem or an oasis under a star. Though pageants, carols, and those drippy little candles might confuse you, I'm just the inn. My job is to say to you and everyone else, I am full of many good things, but go around back to the stable in your heart And there you will find the child with Mary and Joseph and the sweet mashup of woolies, camels, and angel hosts. That's why I miss you most. A sanctuary can store a lot of hay, 
but you are the manger.